the ASEAN Master Plan is a milestone for the movement, especially for the equal opportunity for women and girls with disability in terms of uh, political participation and public life. And I think the master plan is going to be the key to monitor uh, the implementation, especially the CRPD principles, uh, specifically on Article 9 on the political participation. And I think it will also increase the awareness of uh, disability and gender in terms of political participation in ASEAN region. So what I learned from the regional dialogue is that um, the importance of political participation that has intersectionality for all of the sector in the development framework at the regional level. I understand that through this regional dialogue we can develop more awareness, uh, capacity building, political commitment for the ASEAN countries and also the disability rights movement on how to work together at the regional level to apply the global framework which is the CRPD and also the sustainable development goals and through this uh, master plan and I think this master plan like a, a bridge for us to work together coming from the different background and cultural values but in the regional uh, area and I think this is very important on how to articulate the uh, global framework into the regional framework and how to do it and how to apply in each country in the regional framework.